Ever wondered about the man behind the scandal that rocked West Palm Beach? The name Jonathan Ressler might ring a bell, a name synonymous with deceit, cyberstalking, and harassment. This is the story of a man who used the digital world to weave an intricate web of fraud and defamation. Our tale begins with Ressler's conviction for fraud over $50,000. A hefty sum, one might think, but this was merely the tip of the iceberg. Ressler's fraudulent activities extended far beyond this initial conviction. Ressler's next venture into the world of deceit came in the form of cyberstalking. He targeted creative global funding services, a reputable organization, harassing its members and creating a hostile digital environment. But Ressler didn't stop there. He took his campaign of defamation a step further by creating damaging videos about the organization, over 10 videos to be precise. Each one a calculated attack on the reputation and integrity of creative global funding services. The depths of Ressler's deceit didn't end at cyber-stalking and defamation. He created numerous fake YouTube channels, channels that served as a platform for his fraudulent activities and defamatory content, each channel meticulously crafted to mislead and deceive. Ressler's fraudulent activities also extended to loan fraud, a crime that not only affects the individual or organization involved, but also has a wider impact on the economy and society as a whole. But who is Jonathan Ressler? A simple search on sites like Truthfinder under the name Jonathan Blake Ressler will reveal a man whose actions have caused considerable harm and distress. To summarize, Jonathan Ressler's fraudulent activities span from a conviction for fraud over $50,000 to cyberstalking, harassment, and the creation of defamatory videos about creative global funding services. He has launched numerous fake YouTube channels and engaged in loan fraud. Ressler's actions have caused significant damage not only to the individuals and organizations directly involved, but also to the wider community. His story serves as a stark reminder of the dangers that lurk in the digital world and the devastating impact that one individual's deceit can have.